another snowless winter in Kiddie Zooland. Pa, snow's overrated. Have you ever heard of cake? Oh, Esme, you can't go sledging in cake. You can't make a snowman out of cake. And you can't have a snowball fight with cake. I beg to differ. It's just not the same. Hmm. I can't bear to see Olivia upset. There must be someone who could help make it snow. Oh, I can make it snow all right. <gasps> who is that? You need not know my name. Liliana. Oh, all right, it's me. What are you doing lurking in the shadows? I got locked out of my lab. Where's your screwdriver? I left it inside. I've been trying to short circuit the entrance codes for hours. Leave this to me. Anyway, about that snow. Leave it to me. <gasps> snow! I can't believe it. It's actually snowing. Well, <laughs> sort of. We just thought that if it wasn't going to snow for real, we could make our own. Oh, you guys, this is going to be the best winter ever. <laughs> a snow machine, eh? Well, how about we give those princesses a snowball fight they'll never forget? <laughs> oh, it's a perfect winter wonderland. What could possibly go wrong? Huh? Anyone for a snowball fight? Run! Quick, in here! I can wait here all day, princesses. <sighs> of course Mallet would have to ruin things. What are we going to do? Don't worry, guys. I've got this. That's her answer to everything. <laughs> Worth a shot? Right. Anyone else? Well, if it's a snowball fight she wants, I say, let's give her one. <sighs> oh, no. I seem to be out in the open without protection. What am I going to do? Huh? Now! You'll have to do better than that, princesses. Right, we're going to have to think outside the box. Have you got any ideas? Hang on. The snow globe. That's it. Oh, Malice. Pa, you think you can stop me with a bubble? Time to put this thing into overdrive. Huh? Ah! ah, the perfect snowy scene. A snowman, an igloo, and of course, a giant snow globe. Keep your eyes peeled for the zooberry tree, Esme. It's notoriously hard to find. I think it's just around the corner. That's amazing. Well done, Esme. And here it is. Yuck! This is strange. Very strange. Right, come on, Esme. To the palace. Princesses, something bad is happening to the forest. There's slime everywhere. The fruits are all rotten and I think it's spreading. Um, guys, you might want to have a look at this. <gasps> what is that thing? It's like a giant beanstalk. Mmm, giant beans. Let's get a closer look. What is that thing? This is CCTV. 
Crow's Circuit Television. It can fly right up to that weird plant thing and we can see what it is through the screen. Fly, my pretty, fly! Mwahaha! <laughs> this potion is working perfectly. Soon the whole forest will be doing my evil bidding. What a productive day this has been! <gasps> Malice is trying to take over the forest with some sort of evil beanstalk! Huh? Oh, nice try, princesses! It must be that green potion that she's using to water it. I think I've read about this somewhere before. Aha, uh -huh, here it is. The fiendish forest potion. With this potion, the forces of nature will soon be at your command. The spell can only be reversed using the purest Susan water from the spring of Mount Zuza. Ah! ah. Mr. Zuza! What are you doing here? The question is not what, but when. Do you have any pure Zuzan water by any chance? The question is not do you have, but when. Onions? The question is not onions, but... <laughs> there we are. Pure Zuzan water. Nice one, Esme. Now let's get to that beanstalk before it's too late. The question is not... Oh. Right, princesses, we need to be stealthy. Follow my lead. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering when you lot would turn up. Well, you're too late, I'm afraid. The potion is in full swing, and soon the whole of this forest will be under my command. Not if we've got anything to do with it. Right, princesses? Princesses? <laughs> Prepare to be slimed, Olivia. Huh? Oh, quick, Esme, chuck me the ball. I can't. Mm -hmm. ah! There, fly, my pretty, fly. Nice one, Liliana. We saved the forest. Um, not quite. There, that's better. Um, Isabella, you missed a spot. Oh, I'll get you, princesses. This is going to be the most powerful one yet. I can't wait to show the princesses. Oh, it must be a crystal ball. I've been needing a new one for ages. But how do I get my hands on it? Oh, it's time for yoga. Esme's late again. I'm late, Isabella. Needed to make sure I had my grape smoothie. Uh, Esme, you're getting mud everywhere. Felix, Esme's here again. Thanks, Felix. Ooh, is that what I think it is? Wait until the other princesses are here. Aww. OK. Come on, let's get our yoga on. I've got to get that crystal ball. Start by taking a deep breath, then slowly exhale, feeling all negative energy leave your body. Now, slowly transition into downward facing surprise egg. Spread your arms wide and flap them like wings. You are soaring above the clouds. Ooh. 
Now soar back down to the ground and imagine you're at a beach with crashing waves. Wow, I can really hear the waves. You're now sailing on the water. Bend your knees and feel the water move beneath your feet. <sighs> now, because you're a star, do some star jumps. Whew, it's getting hot in here doing all these star jumps. Yeah, you're right. I'll turn on the fan. Uh-oh. And finally, take a deep breath and open your eyes. This has been Yoga with Dave. Oh, they're here. Finally mine! The crystal ball is mine! Crystal ball? Huh? Wow, it's incredible! That has to be the strongest bath bomb yet! Bath bomb? Uh... You sure know how to throw a party, Isabella. What a fun! <laughs> <laughs> there, that should do it. Ready, Timothy? Good evening, residents of Kitty Zoozaland. I'm Malice, the most powerful witch around. But of course, you all know that already. As I am Wait, so Esme, what's that, this? Quite frankly, it's boring. I have decided to change this awful green forest to a more appropriate colour. Purple! <gasps> Behold, the Purplifier 3000! <laughs> well, that's not too bad. Oh, and also, by turning the forest purple, the trees will all rot. <gasps> Come on, princesses. We have to stop her. Oh, and also, I've built a giant and beastful maze around my tower so no one can foil my genius plan. Let's see. Turn the forest purple. All the trees rotten. Oh. Giant awesome maze. Yep, that's it. <laughs> OK, game plan. Liliana, keep an eye out for trouble. Have you got your slime launcher? Isabella, have you got your magic direction-seeking mirror? And Esme, have you got your... Ah! OK, break. Wahaha, <laughs> everything is going to plan. Wahaha, <laughs> you have arrived at the first challenge. Answer this question if you wish to pass. Raisins, currants and sultanas are all dried forms of which fruit? Got any idea, Liliana? I, I, I don't know. Oh no, what are we going to do? That's easy. Grapes! Ooh! Wait, Esme, it could be a trap. Ha ha ha! Silly princesses! Whoops! Don't worry, princesses, I've got this. Great thinking with that flame spell, Olivia. Yeah, flame spell. Whoa! <laughs> Time for round two. What colour do you get when you mix these two potions? Oh, I know this. It. Wait, this is malice we're talking about. Mm, purple? <gasps> Fine. Go ahead, princesses. Hmm, I wonder which way we should go. 
This way. Mwahaha! We have reached the final and most difficult challenge. Get through this door. Wait, that's it? Well, the door is really hard to get through, okay? Okay, game plan. <laughs> One day that's going to work. Anyway, how are we going to get through? Don't worry, I've got this. Pin, do your thing. Aha! Kitty Zuzaland is saved. Esme, there's just the light switch. <laughs> and now for the main event. The best way to find berries is to go down on your hands and knees and look really closely. Wow, Esme, you sound like you really know what you're doing. Maybe I should keep a lookout up here and you can search down there. Okay. Phew. I don't know what to make today. Oh, I know. How about a machine that... Uh Whoa, I must be allergic to these. Interesting. <laughs> there. Now whenever something bad is about to happen, we'll know about it beforehand. Awesome! Huh? I don't feel so good. Hachoo! <gasps> what could it be? I don't know. Maybe it was something she ate? Isabella, did Esme eat Malice's mystery grapes from her garden again? No, no. We were just walking through the forest. Esme was sniffing everything like usual, and then she started sneezing, and everything was turning giant. Hmm, very interesting. Who could that be? Dr. Esselin. Nice to meet you. Oh, poor Esme, you look horrible. Um, who exactly did you say you are again? Dr. Esselam. I make house calls throughout Kitty Zuzalan. I got a phone call from, um, Mr. Snuggles. Mr. Mr. Snuggles? Snuggles? Yes, that's right. Now, Esme, what seems to be the problem? I keep sneezing and making things giant. Good, good. Good? Ah, no, I mean bad. But don't worry, Dr. Eslam will cure you. All you'll need is to hold the spider up close to your nose and you'll stop sneezing. Hey, isn't that...
idea, Squig. I feel quite at peace. <gasps> grape? Floor grape. My fourth favourite kind of grape. Mmm. Ooh, another one. <gasps> There's loads of them. Mmm. Grapes, grapes, grapes. So tasty, so sweet. I love grapes. They're my favourite thing to eat. Mmm, nom, nom, nom. Mmm, mmm. Nom, 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 nom. Mmm, nom, 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 nom. Mmm, nom, nom, nom. Weird, right? More tea, Livy. Esme. Mm, nom nom nom. Where is she going? Grapes, of course. Flower? Something isn't right here. I can't see where the trail goes. We should follow her. Come on. But guys, the picnic. Ah, uh, fine. You try to do something nice, make things a little alaperto. Mmm, nom nom nom. Mm. Mm. Huh? Wait, bread. <gasps> been at this for hours. Will this trail ever end? She's right, Olivia. We have no idea how much further this goes. Come on, princesses. Esme's our friend. What if the trail leads somewhere dangerous? We need to make sure she's okay. All right, then. Huh? Who is responsible for all this? Bake off? <gasps> Malice's Princess, Princess Pie spell? <gasps> but what does it mean? Esme, we've come to save you. Malice is going to turn you into a pie. Ah! But, but, what? Oh, you guys. Malice wasn't going to turn me into a pie. She wanted me to try a pie. I'm going to enter the Great Susan Bake Off. I wanted Esme's opinion on whether my pie was good enough. Wow, Malice, this whole time we thought you were up to your old tricks, but really you just wanted some advice. We misjudged you, Malice. Sorry. Yeah, Malice, we're really sorry. Sorry, Malice. Yeah. So, what kind of pie is this then, Malice? Bats. Huh? huh? Fascinating. This is some really impressive work. Um, hello? This is just remarkable. I am actually a genius. <laughs> now, time to play some pranks on those pesky princesses. There, all done. Esme, just the person. Here, I want you to test out my new machine, the Food Infinity 5000. Hmm. Hmm. 
<laughs> Wait, that's too much. It's going to... Uh-oh. Ah, this is the life. Huh? Oh no, the bubbles have broken. Esme, thank goodness. Do you think you could help me fix my jacuzzi? Hmm. <laughs> Thanks, Esme. Wait, what? Ugh, gross. <laughs> Ooh, Mr. Zuzu's top tips for the perfect breakfast. Interesting. Ugh. Who was that? Who's there? <laughs> Esme? <laughs> oh no, she's going to turn into something else. I better bring her in before the princesses find out that it's not Esme. Right, time to find out why Esme's been acting so strangely. There she is. Now Esme, look. You've really not been yourself lately. Now, we're not angry. We just want to... Esme? <gasps> Look! Hmm... Ah... Right... Uh-huh... What is it? The trail leads that way. Let's follow it. <laughs> Malice! But why would she pretend to be Esme? I don't know, but we're about to find out. Malice, the game's up. Give us back our Esme. Oh, you can have her back all right, but she won't be Esme for long. Huh? Two Malices? That's double the evil. Hello, Princesses. Um, it's Princesses, actually. Mr. Snuggles! You saved us! Yeah! Oh, I'll wait till the real Esme hears about all of this. Hang on a second. Where is Esme? Oh, hey guys! Come join! There's plenty for everyone! <gasps> hmm. <laughs> 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 Huh? Liliana? Olivia! It worked! What worked? What on earth is that thing? This, Olivia, is a teleport... Your hair looks nice today. Thanks. Um, anyway, this is a teleporting door. Ooh! It can teleport me straight to my lab so I can access it on the go. Amazing! Can we try it out? Of course! Okay, ready? Ready. Oh, just one quick thing before we go. Yes? You have a fruit basket on your head. <laughs> now, it's not quite finished. It still needs the finishing touch. And what's that? A doorbell. Why do I recognise that tune? Well, that's enough of that. Come on, let's go show the others. Esme's Treehouse. <laughs> That's what I think of you, Cake. The no cake diet going well, Esme. <laughs> sure is, Olivia. Just fruit and vegetables for me. Wait, hang on. How did you guys get here? With this, my new teleporting door. No way. Yes way. Try it out. Type in Isabella's house. The cake factory. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Slip of the finger. Isabella! Princesses! OK, I appreciate the gesture, but I've actually already got a front door. Oh, this is my new teleportation machine. Ooh! Cool, eh? Such nice panelling. Uh, I guess. Well, anyway, it can teleport you wherever <gasps> you want. Just type the destination into this keyboard. Wow, be careful Malice doesn't find out about this. Huh? Isabella's right. If Malice gets her hands on this machine, who knows what she'll do with it. 
Oh, don't worry. It's not like she's spying on us or anything. <laughs> right, where shall we go to next? What's that noise? Uh-oh. <laughs> ah! This isn't good. Wahaha! <laughs> Excellent work, Timothy. Think of all the mischief we can get up to with this. Right, princesses, time to reclaim what's ours. That's odd. She's left her door wide open. Malice, the game's up. Give me back my... door. Of course you can have it back, Liliana, if you can guess the correct one. <coughs> you have one guess. Uh, uh, oh, I don't know. Come on, Liliana, you can do this. Are none of them ringing any bells? Bells? Bells, of course. Isabella, you're a genius. Huh? There it is. We did it. Oh, no, you don't. Come on, let's get this thing out of here. Sneeze of Newt? Don't you mean I of Newt? Nope. Sneeze of Newt? Oh, yeah. Are you sure this is right, Liliana? Trust me. This slime recipe has been in my family for generations. It will make the bounciest, squidgiest slime you've ever seen. Now, last but certainly not least, one fluorescent toadstool. Um, I think we're all out. <gasps> that was full yesterday. Someone's been at my toadstools. Well, here's a toad and there's a stool. That won't cut it, I'm afraid. We'll just have to get some more and quickly before the mixture becomes too volatile. Where do they grow? At the very edge of Kiddie Zooza land. But that's miles away. We'll have to take the Liliana Mobile. Uh, is that thing safe? Of course it is. Now come on, we've not got long. She's quite a machine, eh? Uh, yep. And check this out. Oh, that is quite cool. <laughs> on your way to the scrap heap, princesses. Malice. What are you doing here? Just taking my new wheels for a spin. Thought I'd drive out to the edge of Kiddie Zooziland. Maybe pick up some fluorescent toadstools while I'm there. Why do you need fluorescent toadstools? I'm making a mushroom risotto. Um, I mean, I'm making a giant evil mushroom monster. <laughs> right. Well, anyway, I'd love to stay and chat, but that risotto won't cook itself. Monster. I meant monst. Oh, never mind. Let's do this. Whoa! Quick, reel in the ferry. Huh? Fancy a swim, princesses? She thinks she can stop us that easily. Let's take to the waves. Huh? A hovercraft day? Very clever, Liliana. But just one obvious weakness. <laughs> Come on, we're gaining on her. Liliana, watch out! At least we got a soft landing. Malice! Come on, Liliana, let's just go home. We can make the slime another day. No, I've still got one more trick up my sleeve. <sighs> Hold on tight. <laughs> no sign of those princesses anywhere. 
this toadstool for mine. What? Nice try, Malice, but I think you'll be having soup for dinner this evening. <sighs> right, that's it. Library, Olivia. <coughs> it's very <coughs> dusty. What kind of books does it have? Oh, all sorts. Look, the Plumber's Guide to Chocolate Fountains, Neo Zoos and Painters, the Big Book of Soup. But the really interesting stuff is over here. The Magical History of Kitty Zooland. Ah. And that concludes the tour. Right. Tea time, everyone. <gasps> Tea! Can we go home yet, Timothy? Are you all right? Hmm. The Coralia Diamond, widely regarded as the most powerful gemstone in all of Kitty Zooland. Hang on a second. I know that diamond. No wonder my plans are always foiled. They've got a super powerful gemstone on their side. But how will I lure the princesses away from the palace for long enough so that I can steal it? Come on, princesses. Mr. Zuzu's waiting for us. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> Oh, that was the biggest tea I've ever had. Oh, Mr. Zuza certainly knows how to make a hard-boiled egg. And how's about those... <gasps> oh, hello there, princesses. I just thought you'd like to know that I've taken over your palace and stolen your precious diamond. Now, if you could all just go away whilst I take over the world, that would be great. This isn't good. What are we going to do? Make soup? We're going to get our palace back. Oh, yeah, that's what I meant. Now, how do I get you to work? What are the secrets to your power? Oh, there must be an instruction manual for this thing. It's sealed tight. Hmm, Esme, have you still got that boiled egg? Sure do. Wow, that really was a hard boy or dog. Aha! The power of the Coralia Diamond can only be activated by performing the ancient Susan Diamond dance. Wait! I know a shortcut. Come on. Oh, this isn't doing anything. Alternatively, tap the diamond three times and say activate. Oh, for the love of Zooza. Hold it right there, Malice. The game's up. You're too late, princesses. The diamond is mine. And with it, I can finally take over the whole of Kitty Zooland. Mwahaha! <laughs> One, two, three, activate! Come on, you stupid thing, activate! That was amazing! How did you learn such a powerful spell? Eh, uh, instinct, I guess. So, how come the diamond didn't work? Oh, <laughs> that's not the Coralia diamond. That's just a decoration. It's made of crystallised sugar. Well, where's the real diamond then? Oh, I'm afraid that's a family secret. 